Oh, so. How many? This is the fifth <laughs> attempt to take a video. I've been messing with this camera for ages. It won't connect to the software on my on either uh, the um, app on the phone or my laptop. I can't use my desktop because a lightning strike blew my uh, motherboard up. So over a two thousand dollar desktop is now a boat anchor. Now this is my last camera, guys. So if there's no video for a while you know why it is because I guarantee you with all the recent problems I've had with this camera it's going to pack in mm -hmm. and we thought it had actually done it today because we've done five videos and there's been no sound at no all sound. if there's no sound there's something sounds there right mm. it's now I've been on the internet and tried a number of solutions and it's not worked with this camera it's intermittent Sometimes the sound works, sometimes yeah. it doesn't. The last time that we take is nice, right? It's yeah. good, the sound. It doesn't matter whether the external mic's plugged in or the external mic's not plugged in. Now normally what's happening is if I don't have the external mic on, there's a, a humming yeah. noise in the background. It's really loud, really off-putting and you can't hear much. Uh, but like I say, it, it doesn't really matter with this fault. Um, it's hit and miss whether the sound works on the video and we could if we're out doing the video we don't know it hasn't worked till we've actually got home which is the reason we've lost hours and hours of video so anyway that moan over <laughs> I'm hoping this time it's worked if it hasn't I don't know what I'm gonna do because we haven't got any spare cameras which is a reason a good time to mention if you're not helping us on Patreon which is one of the reasons it helps us buy new equipment. I've gone through uh, three um, gimbals. I've gone through two on other cameras. This is my third camera. Um, nothing lasts two minutes here. And the problem is as well, which I found out with my motherboard, you get in touch with uh, Amazon and you've only got a short warranty. And even if they did honor a 12 month warranty, you have to send it all the way back to America, blah, blah, blah. The reason I chose Amazon or eBay is because it's cheaper than buying in the Philippines from like Lazada, and blah, blah, blah. It's good quality. Well, I don't know, I guess it's the same quality. It's the just, same. just okay. cheap, I guess, babe. I haven't got a backup camera, guys, so please bear with me. If there's no videos, please, you know why. Don't abandon us, especially our patrons. Um, yes, we special thank you for the Patreon. And if somebody wants to... <laughs> help us on Patreon, yeah, support our channel, it. we'll appreciate it. <laughs> yes. um, the other thing is, guys, please, please don't click off the adverts because that is what gives us money it's not the views it's if you watch the adverts so if you just click on our videos and then say oh I don't want to watch this advert we don't get anything um, so we really appreciate if you you don't click off the adverts the other thing is the world remit link in the description below it's going to be on all our videos please use it guys there's nobody so far used it if you use it you get twenty dollars off your first transfer as long as it's a hundred dollars or more you'll get twenty dollars cash back and so will we so uh, and if you you recommend anybody that happens to them as well and you get twenty dollars it's easy also right? yeah it's really simple mm -hmm. and world remit is fast and it gives you a good rate so that's then, it i think no i have something to say to bill bill i, I know you're watching Diba. <laughs> I know you're watching. I want you. I want to say thank you for your kindness. And if at that point that you want to come here in the Philippines, I want to look after you. Because um, for me, it's not it's not uh, enough to say thank you. That's why I want to repay your kindness. So. Take care always there and get well soon. Yes. Love you. Yeah. And that goes for me as well, Bill. We're always thinking about you, honestly. 
my friend, hand on yes. heart. Um, we're, we're just blown away by your kindness, um, helping us get this house the way it is. Yes. All this is because of Bill. If it wasn't for Bill, we'd be still living yeah. in a bit of a hole, yeah. wouldn't we, babe? So, I know. Thank you very much. Yeah, so thank you, Bill. So I will be happy also if you come here in the Philippines. Yeah, she means it, Bill, by the way. You know, <laughs> she just come out with it the other night. It wasn't prompted. It wasn't, you know, talked about. I was on my computer and she just told me to, you know, pause it. And she wanted to talk to me and ask me to have a word with you. Yeah. And I said, I don't think you'll take it seriously. And I don't really think he wants to move to the Philippines. But she's, she insisted she wanted to say something. So. Yeah. Uh, take care always there. Yeah, yeah. So, that little moan over, not the bill thing, the, the other thing, yes. we'll get round to what you've been up to now. I make ice candy. And what, what prompted you to make ice candy? Uh, there's only one flavour also. There's only one flavour because... Um, no, I mean, <laughs> why did you decide you wanted to make I ice candy? <laughs> To make money, so it helps also for the ano electric bill, right? Mm, yeah, mm. and it gives you a little bit extra food when you yeah. want to go out and get extra rice yeah. and stuff, like that. If there's some, if if I something to eat, I use the money. <laughs> so, <clears throat> why have you only done one flavor? The money that I have is just enough for one flavor. That's why. Right, so it's. I did. I try. I just try also. You just see yeah. how it goes first. Yeah. Right. yeah, and if it works, I will make a lot, like three to two flavors, something like that. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you're still gonna be making it when you've had the baby. Yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> what about when you're having the baby? No, I'm only being silly. Come on. So, let's show. Let's have a look. Yeah, but make sure don't steal my ice cream, okay? No, you're all right. I think you're safe. <laughs> It doesn't uh, fit in with my <laughs> eating plan, does it? Yeah. Now, when she opened the fridge up and showed me, it's not the chocolate. I thought it was chocolate. No. Did but you she, try that? She was sitting here last night. <laughs> I come in. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> it looked pretty disgusting what she had in the bowl. She was sitting on this little seat. It's clean for your information. What are you on about? I'm not, <laughs> not on about it being clean. I'm, I'm just seat. saying it looked disgusting in the bowl. Like somebody, I'll oh, not go there. But anyway. And she's sitting for ages, bless her, doing this ice candy. It's called mongo in Tagalog. Mongo, because it's got little bits in it, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, like it's a mongo. It's a beans, thing. red. Yeah. It's a colored beans. Now, every time I've got an ice candy, it's not like this. It's not hard. They're, they're pretty soft before you even eat it's the candy. Solid, but these though, are though. solid. Yeah. Yeah, this yeah. fridge is brilliant. So, with that and the ice, as long as it takes off, because we, we've put a few in the shop, haven't we? But we've got to put a sign up. Yeah. That we're selling ice candy, but in this weather, in the summer, the ice candy just it'll just keep yeah going out. It's very hot. Yeah, during but summer. at the minute, with it being rainy season, yeah. yeah, the last thing on somebody's minds to buy ice candy, isn't it? Mm -hmm. So what we're going to do later is we're going to go to the shop and yeah. see. But we'll probably do two videos because this will probably be quite long. Mm -hmm. So we'll cut it up into two videos. Yeah, babe. Yeah. So are you excited? Then I'm excited because my baby has bought me with all her money. All her money's gone on this, a 3D printer, which I've wanted for ooh, as long as I can remember. But it's already I've, open, right? Because I've never had the money. <laughs> yeah, I've already <laughs> opened it because we've done five takes at this guy. This so not this not always sounds. I opened it on the first take, but there was no sound, and then, you know, we did it again on the second, and oh, this is the fifth time, I, I'm hoping it is audio this time. So, she spent all her money, guys, on this for me, and it, it sort of reminds me of all the messages, because I get lots of private messages as well, you know, not just on the, on the channel, and guys that's saying oh she's treating you as an ATM which is a laugh because I've got no money to be treated as an ATM 
But oh, it's just the the treat is an ATM and they just want your money and this that and the other. And I know tons of guys. Many, you're looking at me now. You know who you are. Who are married? They've been happily married for quite a few years, and you know th they've not experienced the kind of things that has happened to a lot of other guys that's come over here. Yeah, that's why you lack you, right? Yeah, but you, you see, lucky. the thing is, guys, you jump in in haste, and the chances are you're going to regret it. Because if you, for example, look, the last thing you want to do is get yes. online and start sending money before you've e even met the girl you're talking to because you're setting yourself up for a financial fall because they will expect it and yes there is some families that expect you as a foreigner to help them out my family's not like that my family hasn't asked me for anything although they'd be barking up the wrong tree because <laughs> I haven't got anything um, but you know, come over, get a province girl, look for a province girl, give yourself a bit of time. Because you go on these websites and the chances are you'll hit on somebody that's just in it for the money. Now I'm not saying they're all in it for the money, of course, there's not. There's lots of guys that, you know, subscribe to our channel that's met girls online and they're happy and they've been together quite a long time. But my advice to you is, as soon as they start asking for money, because you, the same old, same old, my grandma's not well, she's in hospital, or my brother's had an accident, or, you know, you get all them excuses, or, you know, uh, because they're not working, we, we've not been able to buy any food this week, any rice this week, blah, blah, blah. They play on your heartstrings, and us guys, we want to impress as well, so the chances are you're going to send money, blah, blah, etc. So don't do it, don't do it. The first time they ask for money, just blow them out. Because Mel's never asked me for nothing. Nothing. Nor has the family. Anyway, getting back to this. It's big. Just say when. Are you happy? I'm happy. And <laughs> if I threw this at you, it's going to hurt you, let me tell you. <laughs> now, I'm not going to bore you guys with showing you the build like I did with me computer when I built me computer. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some time, build it on my own, uh, obviously on my own, and uh, make sure everything's right, get all the uh, the uh, thing tightened and, and sorted out, and then I'll show you it once it's built because, you know, there's lots of websites you can, uh, channels rather, you can go to to see these things being built and people that's really seriously into them which I'm hoping I'm going to be because everybody says what well, what do you do when you're in the Philippines well if you've got a hobby that's great if you can bring it to the Philippines but I'm busy all the time with my channel with my son with my wife etc I'm never bored and I love sitting on on my computer and just surfing the net and looking at stuff and this that and the other because I'm into Star Wars. I'm a big kid. I'm into Star Wars. Yeah. I've always wanted a Star Wars helmet. You know, the Stormtrooper and the Darth Vader helmet? Never, you know, been in a position to get one of them. Um, Lord of the Rings. I like Lord of the Rings and stuff. So I'm a big fan there. So this is going to be great. I'm really excited. But uh, it's going to take a bit of putting together and getting to work right because it's not like a an inkjet printer where you just plug it in and you start this all the settings need sorting out and software and this that and the other so it's uh, it's not going to be a straightforward thing so that said if i can just remind you guys again please don't click off the adverts it's the only way we earn any money and please click on that world remit link yes i'm asking you to do it because we get something out of it but it is a really really good company and it's fast and it's competitive and if you're in the states canada wherever you are you can use that and you can get money here quick it's easy to sign up it's no big deal is it yeah and it's easy to collect the money you can collect it one of these power one yeah. shops or BDO if you pick or, the money in palawan you have a discount yeah discount also yeah. Whoever picks it up gets a discount. Yeah.
you've, you've earned quite a little bit of money with the money transfers, <laughs> haven't you? And so then, <clears throat> the other thing is people's asking how they uh, send us anything. There's a PayPal link in the description below as well if you want to send a tip, they're calling it on these channels now. If you want to send, or you want to send a parcel through the post, there's a address in there as well. If you want to send a present at any any point for the baby or whatever, people's asked, so I'm telling you, I'm not putting it there because uh, we want you to. <clears throat> Everything's in the description below. You'll find our address. Uh, is the phone number in there? I think our phone number's in there as well for when you're in the Philippines. Send a text. Please don't ring because Mel will not answer it but you can send a text. So that said, don't forget, uh, we'd love you to be one of our patrons and it'll obviously help me get another camera, a backup camera, because I ain't got nothing. And- uh, Wait long, I have something to say. Huh? Okay, continue. Okay, <laughs> over to you. That I know, you mentioned to me that there's a vlogger that said that it's cheaper to live in Thailand than here in Philippines. Did you, did you agree that? No, it's not cheaper to live in Thailand than the Philippines. I can tell you that now that I've got loads of examples, but I'll give you one great example. Mm. A lot of foreigners go over to Thailand because of the girls and the drinking and all that. Well, um, a small beer in Thailand is between 60 baht and 100 baht. Now 60 baht is about $1.30 uh, $1. and 100 baht is about $3 for a small bottle of beer. Whereas if you were in the Philippines, you're paying about 34 pesos for a small bottle of beer, which is... It's called Miglai. It's called Miglai, yeah. Uh, which is well under a dollar. And the red horse, big the jumbo big red horse, 85. 85 pesos, which is about, a, a, I don't know, dollar something. It's not a lot. So you're not paying anywhere near three dollars. And the list goes on and on and on. And changing the subject slightly as well, the visa situation is ridiculous in Thailand. You can only stay for three months on a tourist visa and then you have to leave the country, uh, which a lot uh, go over the border to Cambodia to get the passport stamped and they come back in. So you've got the traveling to Cambodia, you've got to stay overnight if you're a long distance away from the border. So you've got a hotel, and the expenses of being there then you've got to come all the way back then you've got uh, two payments for your passport to be stamped etc so it's a lot of money whereas in the philippines you come here you can stay here for three years before you have to leave and then you just have to go for a little uh, a day or a couple of days over to hong kong or somewhere come back in and start your three years again so don't tell me thailand's cheaper because i've looked into it and it's not uh, and it's not easy to stay there, whereas at least in the Philippines, they make it easier for you to stay here. So that's it. Over to you, Mel. Wait. I would like to say hi to Don Lesky. Hello. <laughs> oh, Don and Emily. Yeah, and Don and Emily. Yeah. Yes. Hi, Don. We just heard from you recently. It's great <laughs> to hear from you. And then um, some of your subscribers me messaged to me on Facebook. What the name? It's um, Noel, Gabino, and Marin Tess. Hello. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Tess. 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 You remember Tess? Yeah, you right? haven't upset me, by the way, <laughs> Tess. <laughs> She's very worried. Yeah, she did not upset me. It's, it's fine. So over to you, babe. This has gone on and on and on. Please hit the like button and please subscribe and share our videos. Thank, Thank you, you for guys. watching. Bye. There's going to be a video too, guys. So the next one will be this built and us at the store yes, with the ice then, candy. And then soon I will, I don't know, I will give birth na. Yeah. Na. I'm excited. I'm not, I'm not scared. I'm not sure she's going to get through this month, guys. Leave a comment, see what you think. <laughs>
We must never stop the way yeah. Birds chirping and I hear my name Grasping into a life Life is happy but it's so